It's new release day! What's up everyone? Today I went to my local card store and picked up one box of 2016 Topps Triple Threads. It's the first ever Triple Threads box I've ever opened, so I'm very excited to rip into this. There's a lot of nice things on the checklist, the cards look really great, so hopefully I'll pull something nice. But without further ado, let's rip into it. So there's two mini boxes in this one box. That's always exciting. And it says here on the box, I'll show you in just one second. So there it is right there, my man Mike Piazza on the front. Just inducted into the Hall of Fame. Congratulations once again. One of the best players to watch while growing up. Got that MLB sticker right there. Another one right here. Tops Triple Threads 2016, Mike Piazza. 2016 Hall of Fame class, and then it says right here, every mini box contains an autograph relic and a relic card, one of which is a triple relic. So that's what we're expecting in this, four hits. There's the back, there's the bottom, and that's pretty much it. That's the box right there, really cool. Slide one of these out, that's a mini box. And slide one of these out, here's another mini box. So we've got our two mini boxes. Too many Mike Piazzas. And that's what we're opening. So hopefully we'll hit something nice. Let's rip into this one first. Both feel same weight wise. And here we go. First mini box. So we're looking for two hits per mini box. Is there any odds anywhere? Yeah, the odds are right back here on the mini boxes. So you probably won't be able to see any of that. But in case you can, you can pause it right there and see the odds. But let's do it. Okay. So, one pack. Pretty fat. Seems nice. Let's see what we get. All right. Let's do it. Okay, so we got one really thick card back there. Probably just a relic. But, let's see what we get. Okay, so we'll start it off with Reggie Jackson. Really nice looking cards. Let me show you the back of it real quick. So that's the base card, not numbered. And that's the back. Really clean looking cards. I like the sheen they have on it, the rainbow sheen as you see there. Looks really nice. Okay, so Reggie Jackson. Then we've got Zach Grenke, Adrian Gonzalez. Now I think the hits are right over here, so I'm going to take the two cards from the back. So we've got a Ryan Braun that's gold or yellow. I'm not sure what parallel that is, but it's out of 150. That's number one of 150, so that's pretty cool. One of 150. Ryan Braun. And then the next base card in the back is Chris Archer. Nice picture of Chris Archer right there. 191 of 250, the green parallel. Nice pitching stance right there. So there's the Ryan Braun. There's the Adrian Gonzalez. And we'll flip it around for the first hit. It's a Brandon Crawford 11 of 25 autographed jersey relic. I usually pull this guy. I pulled him in another product as well. But that's nice for all my Giants fans out there. Brandon Crawford out of 25, red jersey relic. Not sure what jersey that goes to, but the autograph really clean. Very nice looking card, and the card behind it is a Troy Tulowitzki. Wow, that looks sick. Oh my god, what is this? It is not numbered? Wow, I am surprised. Oh, there it is, right there. Two of nine. Two of nine Troy Tulowitzki All-Star Game patches. That is sick. That is absolutely sick. Those patches are nasty, and I've always liked Tulo. I'm a big Rockies fan. The Mets are my longtime fan, but if I had to root for any sports team in baseball that's not the New York Mets, it would be the Rockies. I absolutely love Arenado. I love Tulo. Brendan Rodgers coming up. John Gray. Just a lot of exciting players there. But wow, Troy Tulowitzki all-star game patches. That's sick. That is nuts. Two of nine. Really cool card. Wow. Maybe we're going to have some luck overall. Hopefully the next mini box is even better, but that is pretty sick. And this is when he was on the Rockies too, not the Blue Jays. 
Really cool. Congratulations, you have received an MLB All-Star Game Relic Card from 2016 Topps Triple Threads Baseball. Wow. Sick. That is really cool. Okay. All right, I'm happy about the luck so far. Let's open the next one. I still have not hit any one of ones ever in my lifetime. Any box I've ripped, I have not pulled a one of one. I've not pulled anything ridiculous. The best pull you guys probably saw me pull was the Carlos Correa Gold from High Tech. I've never pulled something like that before, and that's like a $150 card. This one feels a little bit thicker, but I say that about everything, and they're all the same, so. Okay, so another thick card right there. No Deca book, which, if you guys don't know, there is a Deca book in this product that I probably would cry if I pulled it. There's a relic version and autograph relic version. It's a 10 person Met card. And you open it up, it's a deck of book. It has like Nolan Ryan, Noah Syndergaard, Michael Conforto, Mike Piazza, David Wright, Matt Harvey. It's just incredible. 10 Mets players, all autograph and relic in the book. If I pulled that, I would cry, but clearly I did not pull it, but let's see what we get. So we got Max Scherzer, base card right there. Jose Altuve. Sonny Gray. I think these are the hits, so let's move this up here. Another Sonny Gray. So that's 26 of 340, looks like the magenta or purple parallel. 26 of 340. And the next numbered card is Edwin Encarnacion, and that's actually out of 99. So that is 62 of 99, yellow or gold parallel. I'm not sure what parallel this is. There was one that was gold for Ryan Braun, that was the 150. This one's the 99, it looks yellow. Not sure what it is, but that's that. So Edwin, numbered. Sunny Gray, numbered. Sunny Gray base. We'll turn it around, see what we get. And it's Jay Bruce. Relic, 2 of 36. Not on the Mets, but I don't even want him on the Mets to begin with, so <laughs> that's the Reds version of Jay Bruce. 2 of 36. And the next hit is Oh, baby, a one of one, Sonny Gray. Oh, my God, I pulled a one of one. <laughs> you got to be kidding me. Oh, my God. Yep, there it is. <laughs> no way. Oh, that's crazy. That is incredible, and I know the home for this, too. Brian Maeda, you better prepare yourself to pay some money or trade me. <laughs> wow. That's incredible. My first one of one that I've ever pulled. Ever. Wow. That is crazy. That's sick. It says Vandy Dandy. I think that's what it says, but one really nice patch in the middle. Autograph. White Whale. Gray has forged a 2.88 ERA over his first three seasons in Oakland, including a 2.73 mark in 2015 as a credential to finish third in the AL Cy Young Award balloting. A cerebral righty with command of four pitches. He's a consistent ground ball inducer. Foes have batted just 223 against Sonny in his career. Wow. The signing of all Topps autograph cards witnessed by a Topps representative to guarantee authenticity. Wow. My first one of one. There you have it. Sonny Gray. White Whale. Vandy Dandy. Don't know what that means, but. Autograph, White Whale, one of one. What a box. Wow, that was actually an incredible box. I am thoroughly happy about that. And that was one pack full of Sunny Gray. I don't know if you remember, but throw it back. We got a Sunny Gray base card. Then we got the Sunny Gray purple. That's the 340, 26 of 340. And then we hit the White Whale. That's pretty crazy. Three Sunny Grays in one pack. I guess they just want me to go for the rainbow. So, wow, that is nuts. Well, that's all for this video. Let me recap real quick. Once again, we got the white whale. If you were sleeping, you have that. You got the two and nine Troy Tulowitzki all-star game patches, which is just also incredibly nuts. Sick card. Then we've got Jay Bruce, relic, two of 36. Not on the Mets, but he is a Mets player, so that's pretty cool. And the last hit was a Brandon Crawford 
autograph relic to 25, 11 of 25. Wow. Okay, well, that was one heck of a box, one heck of a break. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on this video, subscribe for more content, and also you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Regicidal, and on my card Instagram at Cardicidal, and I'll see you all in the next one. My first one of one was pulled. Later, everyone.